boys and girls, we are headed out to the party grounds here out of New Smyrna Beach, uh, Ponce Inlet. This is Monday, I think it's uh, Leap Year Monday, 29th of February. And you can see these are big choppy waves heading out of the west, heading towards the east. And we have had to go real slow because of this little boat, it's pretty dangerous out here. I don't advise anybody coming out in a little boat like this. Let's see, there's four or five boats out there. Uh-oh. I think we lost a cylinder. Yeah, I think we did, John. Thank you. It's a long ride, my friend. We're not leaving. Smile, you're gonna be on YouTube. Except there's no swearing on my channel. I think I got something. Yeah, I got something. Big something. Dang. Doggone it, John. It's like an anchor, though. Feels like a shark. But he's not going in circles yet. Got a banky? Well, that first one I had was nothing but a stinky old shark. I don't think this is a shark. Now he's coming up kind of the surface. It is a... What is that? Shark sucker! <laughs> First fish of the day, shark sucker. There you go. We're out here with the uh, the angry crowd. 
these commercial fishermen out here have threatened us. But we're kind of hanging tough since, you know, it's not their ocean, it's God's ocean. And since I have three honorable discharges from the military and three tours in Vietnam, I don't think I'm going to leave right now. I don't care if they threaten me. Let's see what we got here. This is on my new three fly sabiki with about a uh, 5 0 hook on it. But this is the first real fish. I only have one little piece of shrimp on here. So we'll see. Another shark sucker, John. I can't get away from him. That's your boat. I know. We'll see what this is. Probably just a couple of bait fish. One. I caught him by the butt. Caught this one by the butt. Look at that myrtle. Myrtle of turtle right there. Hey myrtle! Big old turtle. Big turtle. Hey myrtle. That's myrtle. We're moving around a little bit. See if we can find some structure somewhere on the bottom. We're getting a few little bites and catching a few little fish. Not much, not much. Try to get away from these nasty commercial guys. Oh, they got a bad attitude, like they own that section of the ocean right over there. And probably here too, you know, anywhere we are. <laughs> We've had to move. Looks like Big John's found the first fish of the day. It might be a keeper. What is it? I'm getting all kinds of little bites down there too. It is, oh, red snapper. <laughs> Can't keep that one, John. Current here is incredibly strong. <laughs> I know, we need to get the stink out of the boat. I'm trying to get a, a vermilion snapper, a bee liner. They were out here last time. I think those commercial guys over there scared them all out, scared them all away. I got two bee liners. No, I mean two. Yeah. Faker. Yeah, fakers, two fakers, two ruby lips. I got it. Okay, what Big John got? So far today, he's my hero. He's catching all the, the fish that could possibly keep. Where'd he at? Oh, I sit down there. Looks like another rip, 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 rip. Triggerfish! Way to go! Trigger! So? He might be. He might be. He me a little bit. Come on now. Let's get a 14 inch trigger. Oh, goodness. What is this, a porgy or something? Boy, this thing's fighting. This is on my sabiki. My Chinese sabiki. Apparently. Something likes it. <sighs> Had to get these from China. They got 50 pound mainline, 40 pound branch. Probably got two, two of something on here. You gotta go to that fork, right? Not to the... I got three fish, John. A blue runner or two. And a red Four snapper. Half. He's 13 and a half. That's not, a, that, that's not a blue runner. That is not a blue. That is a. I don't know what it is, but it's not edible. <laughs> Good blood bait, though, huh? Yeah. You want them? Sure. Because I was going to let him go. Man, they sure like these uh, flies. Yeah, I think that's a blue runner, or just a huge blue runner. Yeah. Now look at this red snapper. 
with this fly all the way down his throat. What's the other one? The other one was a blue runner, but he got off right at the boat. Smaller one though. Yeah, and this, this is a red snapper. This blood bait here. There we go. Goodness gracious. Woo! That was kind of fun. Thank you, Lord, for the fun. Oh, another red snapper. Another red snapper. That's about a 16 incher. There we go. A little piece of squid and shrimp. Not huge. What is that? Oh, another daggum shark sucker. Uh, one more time. We'll bring it up one more time. We'll see if we can get the skunk out of the boat. The answer is maybe, because that's a beeliner. And he looks like he's plenty big enough. Yep. Uh, a little bit on the uh, on the sabiki shrimp and squid. Yeah, and he's a nice one too. If I can make sure that I keep him inside the boat. Yeah, he's a he's a fatty. He's a fatty. Mm, let me let me see how big a fatty he is. He's about 13 and a half. 13 and a half, big John. Big enough, thank you, Lord. Yeah. My boat's getting nasty. Well, we moved a little bit, about 20 feet or so. Try to get a little bit more over this ledge. And this feels more like a red snapper. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is still on my sabiki rig. Yep, red snapper. Sure enough. A rap snapper. Rip snapper. A snapping ripper. It's gonna cut, cut me if I don't watch out. Where my there it is. It's gonna cut me if I don't watch out. They're all kind of about the same size. Not huge. Big enough for a meal, but okay. This feel like another Mr. Red Snapper. Red Snapper. Just another little red snapper. But everywhere, they're everywhere. Doobie doobie doo. It is a red snapper. Red snapper. Just another little red snapper. I'll throw him back. John's got something nice. Mr. John's got something nice. Not really nice. And big. I see him. Eel! A spotty eel. Got a spotty eel of some sort. You know, I, I only allow one of them in my boat at a time. He's a pretty looking thing, though. Look at him, boys. Look at there. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, I will. Grab him right behind the head. Uh, heck no, I won't touch him. Here, put him up here. You want me to just get him off? Sure. Let go. Hey. Don't you come up here and bite me. Yeah, I don't want him to bite you. Undo. Unflip. Flip a doer. God, he got himself all sniggled around here. Oh, look at them teeth. Oh, man. Yeah, they got teeth, all right. Man. If they were so full of bones, they were okay to eat, but they were so full of bones. Uh, no he I chewed through I... your line there. I mean, he chewed right through it. Wow. wow. All right, this is on sardines. It was over. It's over this Simarcand wreck, huh? I got something on here worth looking at, anyway. Could be a a uh, shark sucker. I've already caught three of them. Oh, cobia, cobia, two cobias, right here, and I got a shark sucker. Yeah, there's a Kobe right here, and one went back towards you. Yeah, I got a Kobe down here trying to eat my my ruby lips. Really, trying to eat my ruby. Oh, he had me. There he is. He had that fly for a second. Where's he at now? There, there's the ruby lips. 
He went out that way. He might have broke my fly off. There were two of them though, Robbie. Huh? There were two of them. <laughs> what is this? Oh boy. But it feels red. Let's see if it looks red. I'm pretty sure it's pretty red. Coming up. It is looking mighty red. Oh, shark sucker. I see a shark sucker, but I don't see a cobia. I only got my fly right down in him too. He got my fly right down in him. I let you go, my friend. Goodness. Ugh. I think I got a goldfish. A goldfish. A goldfish. This is on cut ruby. You keep seeing fins break the water around us, but we don't know what it is. Probably sunfish, spadefish. Spadefish or something? Yeah, this is just another one of those multiple so many. Oh boy, I got a tagged one. I got a tagged one this time, Big John. Alright, they are so rare. I got a tagged one. Yeah. And I'm going to turn the number in. Yeah. Ooh, that was a bigger thing. All right. All right. This one is, it was cut on, caught on cut bait. Total length, 15 and an eighth inches. Let me get all this gunk off of here. He's been in there for a while. EC, green tag. EC 63021, EC 63021, we are at reef number two, safe release, there he goes, down, 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 I don't see any, I don't see any barracudas down there to eat him, no, oh my, well, folks, this is the third spot we've been at today. And we've just stopped here. There's supposed to be a two-foot ledge here. This doesn't feel like a red snapper. I don't know what it is. Oh, I hope it's not a blasted shark sucker already. <laughs> this is looking more like it. Feels like it anyway. What is this? Oh, shark sucker, but I got him by the tail. Got him by the tail. Ugh. Yeah, this is on a piece of cut ruby. This guy feels big and red. I think this is a big and red guy. A big and red guy. It'd be nice if it was a big and brown suit guy. Big and black. Big as long as it's not big and gray. No. Goodness, my word. Oh! Let's see if he broke me off. Doggone it. That was nice. Could have been a shark. Actually, since I lost the sinker and everything, I, I don't think it was a shark. Daggone it. He came up angry after this thing. This is still on the sabiki too. Come on. There we go. We're making some progress. Not seen color yet. Where is he at? Gotta go under the boat. Oh! Uh-oh. Snapper! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. 
Man, they are so rare and endangered. Oh man, I am so, I ought to send this one to the Florida Wildlife Commission. Oh, just kidding. Tell them you got, we caught a couple others. No, we don't lie. We must be making We tease, but we don't lie. Nice one, that was about an 18 incher there. Johnny boy catches another trigger fish. I think it's just loaded down there with triggers. He's still not going to be quite big enough. Mm, lots of triggers. And Big John hooks into something else. Probably another dag of trigger. Looking like a, looking like a little trigger. Golly. Brings up. We got another thumper. Let's see if I can keep this one on. He's going the same place the other one did. But the other one didn't tie a, a, a uni knot and it broke at the knot. This one's a uni knot, so I hope I can keep him on. Get that other line up? Nah, I don't think so. He doesn't seem to be going around crazy. This is not a shark either. Pretty sure. He's a bottom hugger. Nice one too. Mm -mm -mm. Come on, come on. Uh, we'll get you up here and then we'll let you go probably. More than likely. It seems to be the day. Yeah. The soup du jour, the fish du jour has been red. Bait or back. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Bait or back. That's a good one. I don't see any color yet. I keep hoping I'm going to have to go get that net. We'll see what he looks like first. I might want to measure him if it's a snapper. And I think it probably is. I see color. He looking awful reddish. Or oh, did I hook him? A foul hook something? What did I get? It's going oh, he, uh, yeah, he's coming up sideways. Or he's twisted. That's all. No, I hooked him. Hooked him in the butt. Hooked him in the belly button. How in the world did that happen? Uh, I hope. Uh, I hope he's gonna be okay. I'm not going to get him out of the water. That's about a 22 incher there. All right, Big John got himself a nice big trigger, 14 and a half inches. So we both got the skunk out of the boat, but just barely today. It's going to be the last fish of the day for me. It's been a red snapper, throwing back kind of day, except for one vermilion that I was able to put in the cooler. And John put a trigger fish in the cooler, so we both got the skunk out of the boat. Ooh, I thought I lost him there for a minute. And my buddy Robbie, way over there, about five miles, just called me and said he caught a cobia on a mud minnow. Just barely legal big enough. But hey, barely legal big enough is big enough. You betcha. Yep, yeah, that's a nice. Yep, yeah, let's see how big this guy is. And I'll let him go. He is 20 inches. If I wanted to cheat, I could take him in shore and say I caught him in shore, but I don't cheat. No, <laughs> John, you're bad. <laughs> All right.